Alrighty, we're back on the rim. Good times. So, after yesterday's fiascos, let's try and uh, fix this colony back up. Oh, there we go. But good straighter coming in, quite nice. Um, did we clear all of the mechs from over here? We did, didn't we? Yeah, was it here? I forget. Yes, it was here. Right, yeah, we have done. Okay, cool. So, who do we actually have that was original colonist? Dibbert, Mr. No Cutman, the third? Zanyal and so much puke, yeah. Kim and Rachel are newbies, and we also have um, she, who's going to be joining us quite soon. Once her resistance is broken, she's currently at 0 0.1. Yes, I remember. Sweet. Now, do we need a bulk goods trader? I don't know. Have we haven't got anyone social anymore because Josh was. Uh, Yorg was killed? Yorg was killed. Hey, Mr. No. Welcome back, sir. Welcome back. How's the Minecraft going? Um. So, Dibbert's gonna have to be the new social dude. Do you want to come and call them? I don't think we've got anything to give them. We do have a few things to sell, though, which is quite nice. So, let's have a quick look. Um, ooh, there's so much stuff. Components. I feel like we need components. I know we need one more advanced component for something. I can't remember what it was for. So let's try and make some cash. Oh, here we go. Yeah, we've killed lots of things since. So that's good. Okay, 1,449. I feel rich again. Yeah, man. So let's take all of the components. Uh, we can sell the drugs. We don't need the drugs right now. I do want to get into drugs at some point just because apparently they've been improved the way that they work. Um, we have that tech print as well. We're going to learn that. Neuro neurocomputation. Um, I think we can sell that. And we can sell the smoke pot belt since they're single use and largely useless. What I'll do for now is we actually make some cash. I'm trying to work out whether we actually need the neutroamine. Whether it's a good idea to take it. Because it's at a decent price. But I think there's more important stuff to worry about right now. Uh, Neutroamine is not one of them. So I think what we needed to build was a bionic arm, yes, for so much puke. So we're going to make a bionic arm. But we have no one to do this. I remember. I remember. Nobody of skilled intelligence to make. A bionic arm. She has been broken. Now I believe uh, Zong, who we're going to name is She Zong from the last stream. I believe somebody wanted that character. The amount of food is looking so good. I want to get this deconstructed as well. So do I have a constructor? Yes, Mr. No and Cutman both on the constructing. Cotman currently deconstructing sandstone wall, Mr. No hauling to an invisible power conduit. What invisible power conduit? Oh my redundancy lines, I remember. Okay. So let's have a look at the completion of that. Ooh, looking good. Alright, redundancy lines are in place. I think this can be deconstructed, it serves completely no purpose. I need that power line back on though, please, so Yes, power. There we go. No, power. There we go. I can't see where it is, I'm just guessing here. There we go. Let's deconstruct that. Deconstruct there. I will get it. There we go. Deconstruct. Okay, it ends there. So, power. Do that, that, and that. Could you deconstruct? Sweet. That is a much better grid. Okay. Okay, good. I feel like we should tap. Oh, we've got those muffalo as well. Do we want to murder some muffalo? Just so we really don't have to worry about food. Mr. No, what's wrong with you, mate? Quite a lot. Spires in 20 days. Don't forget the mech and mortars. We did that. Dealt with that, bro. Sorted. But we do need to um, discombobulate those mechs. 
And we do need to make sure that these are loaded. Uh, stop force attack and hold fire, please. Um, I'm not going to ask Mr. No to do anything in particular because I think he's quite pissy and he's going to get um, a bit annoyed. You missed it. Oh man, it was. That's why everyone's dead. <laughs> I was left with five colonists yesterday. Crazy, everyone died. <laughs> well worth a catch up. So I'm actually going to kill these in Buffalo. I'm going to bring everyone for it. Oh, that's right. I was going to wait. I was going to wait until Kim and Rachel were at a decent moving speed. That was the plan. Yeah, because they were quite slow. I think everyone's armed now. Yes, everyone has a weapon. Is that a quest? Yes, it's a quest. Oh, don't ask me to build another monument. God, God's sake. Must that you build a monument to insult the eating habits of her rival. Okay. 50 by 11 in size. Um, requires quite a lot of stuff. 13 days and we will get royal favour, helmet or some goodwill. I'll probably do it for the royal favour to be fair. If any piece of it is destroyed, the Acolytes enforcement system will activate a pack of 34 man-hunting castle worries will arrive. Ugh. And we've got to protect it for 40 days. For 5 royal favour. 40 days. I don't think so. Only just destruct deconstructing this one. We'll do the next one when the rewards are actually a little bit better. Rachel's received, uh, got to level 11 in construction. It looks like she's about to be recruited. There we go. So, welcome to the colony. Uh, was it Zong? I think it was Zong, wasn't it? There we go. Let's schedule you some stuff. Let's have a quick look at you, actually. So, you're shooting animals and artistic. So, you'll be primarily on artistic, helping with construction, hunting, and you're definitely hunting because you've got animals and shooting. We need to give you a good weapon. Hmm, a masterwork bow. Well, you can't go wrong with that, can you? So come and equip that. She's naked, but... Well, can't have everything. So we'll get to be a patient. Don't do that, do that and that. Yes, handle. Yes, hunt. Are you an animal handler? Kind of. Are you the best? Kind of. Right, okay, no worries. Stay on it. Uh, construct when you're not doing anything. But I want to do the general hauling duties of unloading caravans, doing cremation bills, refueling fuelable structures. Um, I think we can probably get you on mining because there's no construction to do. And then you can do some plant cut growing. Plant cut for plant growing. And you can definitely do art. You are my artist, correct? Yes. No, cut this. Okay, no problems. You're passionate for it, but you're not very good at it. Whatever. So schedule, what were your traits my dear? You are pyromaniac, body purist and a teetotaler. Two out of three there, They're pretty annoying. Pyromaniac's not the the worst, but it's annoying. And body purist is just irritating if we need to fix you in any, any particular way. Colonist left unburied. Huh. Huh? Ah. Can we get cut in a second? Rid off please. Cutman the third is carrying Cutman the second. Oh, the time paradox is rife. <laughs> uh, schedule, you can do what you want when you want. And assignments, attack things, please. Sweet. Right. Does she have a bedroom? Yes. You can have this one, please. There we go. Right. We're good. So what's the next plan of action I hear you say? Well, I do not know. We have enough food. What should we aim for next? We need a crafter. So we need someone that can craft. And the closest person, oh my god, a four. Ooh, that's going to take a while. Mr. No, you're going to have to get good at smithing, my friend have to get good at smithing. What I can do about that? 
Oh, is somebody on mining? No, so Mr. No, you go do that. We'll just have to deal with this another time. It's gonna have to be done. Is there someone on cooking as well? Yes, we've got people on cooking. It's fine. I'm not entirely sure what I need to do here. And what, what I should be aiming to do. I think security is pretty okay. Are enough traps in the base? Kill box is something to be desired for, but I'm very tempted just to whack a wall here. I feel like this is going to be my downfall. Well, then again, I could put a big ass, badass turret in the corner, like a, a blast turret or something. Pew, pew. And I feel like we're going to have to double wall this anyway. Okay. Mm. I have to double wall that. It needs to be done. There's nothing I can do about that. Just because it's going to get blown up. Several times. Ambrosia binge on Mr. No Life. Enjoy the drugs, my friend. It's probably one of the better breaks. At least we've not got Slaughterer. Even though there's only one more animal to kill. So we could do with actually getting some more animals back in. Now that we've got the food to support it. Speaking of food, let's take most people out. You're now at 76%. Kim's just fully healed. So let's go hither. Come to me jungle friends. Hope everyone's armed. Yes, I know there's a major break risk. It's fine. I expect all new prisoners generally to break straight away anyway. You imprisoned me! Yes, but I also let you free. No one's managed to pull aggro yet. Nice. Okay, so this group we will take. You guys will grab them, please. No, you guys will all grab them. I'm telling you, you will grab them. You will grab them! Everybody grab a muff, please. Thank you. Kim, grab a muff. Everybody grab a muff. Thank you. There we go. Puke, why did you not come with me? You lazy bugger. <laughs> Zerk on Kim. Because the corner is left on belly. Yeah, but Kim was going to break anyway. I'm trying to fight with Zong. Grab an eclipse. Let's see what happens here. Might have to go and subdue her. She is the only, one of the only colonists that's actually wearing armor. Cutman's quite armored. Do you want to come here, please? Melee attack Kim. Come on, she's taking the new girl down. Come on, don't cause me problems. We still got colonists left unburied? Surely not. Oh my god. Lanex. We need to get rid of Lanex. Okay, Cutman's got you. Hopefully, Cutman's got you. Come on, Cutman. Stop trying to hit her and hit her. There we go. Now, Cutman should win this war. We hope. Uh, Zaniel? Yo! Yo! Melee only, let's not kill the poor thing. So there's nothing to the chest or the head or anything, so we should be okay. There we are. Yo, do you want to rescue Kim? <sighs> these people, man, these people! Major break Lucy, yeah. I think I feel like I might get everyone on the Lucy and see what happens. <laughs> anyway, Zong's nearly made it back. Hopefully she'll go to sleep now. She is pissed. Connor's left unburied. Okay. So puke, lazy bugger. You'll never do hauling, that's probably why. And um could you come and like haul Lennox please? Before everyone snaps. And for removing floors. 
Grazie. Yeah, can I, you actually like cremate him, please, so people's moods go back up? Thank you. All right. Anyone else still pissed? Hungry, slept in the heat, and your friends died. When's that going to drop off? Six days. Okay. Medical emergency on Zong. What? What? Blood loss extreme. What the hell from? Oh, you just got in consciousness because you were beaten up. Right, okay. So you'll actually be fine. Rachel's fine. Cutman's fine. Samuel's fine. Kim is not fine. I only have one doctor. Mr. No Life, where you at, bro? It's broken. Of course you are. No worries. So much puke's got this. I think it's about time I join the colony. I'm going to be the next new recruit, regardless of who it is. I'm going to be the next new recruit. Have a bulk goods trader again. Mm, we could investigate, see what they've got. We could also install this flat screen TV. I'd completely forgot about that. We'll just put it there so people can watch from their dinner tables, I think. Could go against that wall. The psychic drone on the females. I feel like Randy's gonna have a go at me again today. <sighs> Give me a break, Randy. Puke. Just you in a simple meal, that's fine. Could you then come and like apply the tech print, please? We're gonna have breaks everywhere here. Oh, give me strength. I've only been charged at the colony for 20 minutes. <laughs> so we've got neurocompensation. Problem is now, um, oh, we've completed the project's tech print requirements, have we? Have we? Can we do it? We can do it. It only requires one, then, apparently. So this will give us learning assistant and a neuro calculator. I have no idea what either of these things do. But we'll learn it and find out. A little tantrum on Zanyu. I'm just going to go smash things in his room. That's probably the best thing for me. Ground penetrating scanner is now complete as well. So. No, it does take an advanced component. Construction needed eight. We can build this. So let's build the ground pen. Now it needs to be in a place where it's not going to get battered. And it's a workable unit now. It's no longer a. Um, just a thing that you leave, it's like you actually have to sit down and work on it. And it also needs to be outdoors. Um, catatonic on so much puke. I've not seen catatonic for a very long time, but he's down for a while. So why are we putting this? Why are we putting this? I mean it doesn't need to be outside, it just needs to be unroofed. Could run it at the back here. We only have one researcher, so I only need one right now. Cool. It's probably going to need a little wall around it or something. Let's cancel it for now. So. Oh, I don't know. I want it safe. Safe by outdoors. In the middle, maybe? No. Not there because of the kill box. Where is it safe? <laughs> here, perhaps? I think here might be safe. We can put a little wall around it. Yeah, it's probably there. We'll just leave it like that for now. I always build a second one if it needs to be there. Because we're going to have two researchers at some point. So, Hey Lennox, how's it going man? Nice to see you bro. How's life? So Puke's in a catatonic state and he's going to be there for a very long time. It takes about a week. So, whatever on that. No research for a while. We need a research project anyway, so we had nothing to do. Um, what is the most important thing to do? What the hell just happened? 
Sad wonder on Cutman because of the psychic drone. Fantastic. Give me strength. Let's do um I feel like vitals monitor is important, but that I wonder what the neurocomputation is. I'm gonna check that out a little bit. Since it's a new thing. Okay. So what have we lost here? Cutman is a builder type people, I think, is he? What does he do? Yeah, construction. Okay. Now oh, we've lost Puke, who is my researcher. So that sucks. At least Mr. Nola is feeling better. I mean, he's got a moderate psychic drone with the uh, York died, but he does have catharsis for another 2.5 days. Yeah. Yeah, man, chilling. Quiet Sunday, good times. Colony's okay. Um, I feel like Randy's going to test me today. I feel like it's going to get a bit difficult. But we should be okay. Unhappy nudity on Zong. Okay, we need to make some clothes. So I need some kind of crafter, which is Mr. No Life. And something to make clothes out of. We have blue fur. Could you come and make. Ah, oh, there's no power on it. That's why. Mr. No Life, come and flip the switch, please. But yeah, chilling today. It's been a good day. Spent a few hours with my boy and then um, went and fed the ducks, threw stones in the river, and then streamed. Good times. What more do you need in a day? Played some Warcraft, got no loot. Standard. Fire starting spree on Zong. As long as it's outside, I'm gonna ask. Whoa! Yo, not in there. Daniel! Fire foam. Ah! Can't light a fire in there, darling. Puke's just covered in fire foam. She's thinking, why won't this fire start? Why can't I start a fire? No, no, I can. I'll put the fires out. The pyro's having a field day. I don't mind over there. It's fine. They can rage. But I'm pretty glad I put fire foam in there. Who's a clever boy? You're a doctor, miner, crafter, gunner. What else don't I do exactly? You're also an ace tailorer. You got the skills. Do 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 do. I'm just going to force you to do this though because she needs some clothes. A bit pissy right now. Okay, so she's recreation unfulfilled, disturbed, sleep, psychic drone. Yeah, this is a psychic drone that's causing her problems. Uh, pharmaceutical trader flying over. We'll get Dibbert to come and call them. Just in case they've got beautiful things for me. It's generally just drugs. Yes, it's drugs. So we've got a sale on yeah, yo, wake up, uh, beer, and smoke leaf joint. Should buy some drugs for now. Ooh, can't afford that. Let's buy. Oops. Yo, two, zero. Okay. Why are you not working? Apparently, I can't write numbers in there for some reason. Okie dokie, that's because I'm in the wrong box, you silly, silly boy. There we go. Buy 20 of them. We'll buy 20 bears as well. Because I'm, I feel like treating my boys and girls. Grab a smoke, boys. Grab some weed. Grab a drink as well. It's legal in this place. Um, Dibbert, what are you doing? Sowing heel roots. Um, how much heel root do we have? 52. Uh, yeah, could you come and sew this first, please, though? If you would not mind. I won't turn something off on this because it won't make it into winter. Potatoes. Could maybe sew another crop in there, but I don't think we're going to make it. I don't think we're going to sew any more cotton uh, this season. 
well considering we had a cold snap at the start we've actually managed to gain quite a lot of food I'm quite impressed with that once Dibbert's done this I'm gonna get him to um, remove some floors over here I'm gonna get Mr. No to come and also remove some floors Cutman's back with us nice how's he feeling a little better than he was Pukey Boy is gonna be down and out for a while on the thread isn't a whole lot I can do about that. It's no longer got inspired creativity. But we are a strong, strong colony of eight people right now. Another pharmaceutical trade is flying over. We know that it's a drug dealer, we just won't deal with them. It's amazing how much construction speed matters. Look how fast Tibbet's going compared to Mr. No. That's a difference of 11 versus. 16. That's speedy. But that's this monument deconstructed anyway. We can now accept another monument building quest. Preferably one with decent rewards. The last one, for me, didn't have enough rewards. Sultan Spree on Mr. No. Come on, he wasn't even being forced to do anything. He's now going to bring Divot down. Why is no one delivered to the television? Oh, we got a psychic ship. Oh, come on. Why is it dropped? Oh, and it's got mechs with it as well. Okay. Okay, okay. Do we have enough unbroken people? We have to deal with this. The psychic drone low on the males. So let's have Zaniel, Rachel, Cutman. And Zong, come here. You guys get ready. Animals, animal, can you stay in the base, please? And everybody else, stay in the base, ta. So, you boys, oh, I like this little bar that we've got. It shows when they can fire, that's new. So, we're just going to hold these boys here. And then we're going to say, Could you please attack? this area. You absolutely missed apart from you took out the raccoon. Excellent shooting. Good work guys. Try again. Pew 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 pew. Miss 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 miss. There we go. We killed a, a um, lancer by the looks of it. I just want to pop the ship. I'm not bothered about anything else. If we can get the animals to revenge that would be even better. I don't think they can from mortars. A couple of direct shots on the ship will make them come to me anyway. Another good shot. 17%, so one more hit please. Okay, there we go. Positions of the defensive variety, thank you, all of you. You guys, you still don't have defensive positions, come here. Is that everybody? Kim. Oh my darling, Kim, come here. Thank you. And of course, Puke's not going to get involved. So you guys. So I'm go there. You guys will remember them, please. Shot. Kind of like half built the wall. There's a couple of knackered up. We're not waiting for these. I'm just going to kill the frontliners. And we'll let the turrets do the rest. I'm not risking any more breaks or anything like that. Kill the Lancer, please, quickly. He's got charge rifles. Come on. And the other one. Quickly. Someone took a hit there, I think. Actually, no, we're okay. Last one. Right, boys, come on. What did we win? Apart from a lot of dead muffalo. Advanced component, nice, 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 nice. We're going to collect all that stuff shortly. Turret should be enough to take care of this. Anyone who's in a good mood actually can come back. Which is you guys, actually. Might as well train some shooting while we're doing this.
I think these are the last two. Yeah, we've just got two more to go. So nobody took any, any damage, which is nice. Last one. So animals, you're unrestricted, and everyone else is unrestricted. I want to get all the lancers hauled in. I want to get all of the um, pikemen's hauled in. There's no scythers there. We'll add those to the list, and we'll get them hauled. And we may go and kill the muffler whilst we're here. Did they get the mood bonus from that? No, so it doesn't count as a mech cluster, unfortunately. Did we get all of the... Yes. How much meat do we have? Quite a lot. So, moods are good. Come with me, boys. And girls. Why are you going that way, Kim? Surely that was not the quickest route. I'm going to build a bridge across here, I think. I'm just going to put you on the uh, drafted hunt. That might be a bit too close, but we're okay. Pew pew, pew pew. Pew pew, just finish off those ones that are. Not quite dead. Slip them all up. Haul. Slow down. Guys haul. So if you're not hauling. It's close enough to me. You've got that. Okay, you've got that. Kim's got that. Zaniel's grabbing that. That's fine. Can we get the advanced component? No, Zaniel. Do you want to haul that, please? Do you want to haul them. Okay, good. Good work, guys. And moods are still high, apart from Dibber, who's just having a bit of a whinge, but he's okay. He was insulted, to be fair. All in all, 100% successful trip. Nice. Okay, back up. It's back down to 13 degrees outside as well, so I'm actually going to stop sewing this. We're not going to sew this again. We're not going to sew this again. We'll keep the rice going until it gets too cold. But I was thinking about greenhousing it anyway. Greenhousing it basically means just putting like the roof on it, heating it up, and putting sun lamps in there. But it would require more power, which is this. So next construction project. Um. We would need a redundant line going south. And just one coming out this way. Should be fine. And we would also need, of course, a wall around it to keep it safe. Which we will touch up soon. Remove the roof area. And of course, we need to zone some home area on this. Oh, I've missed a bit there, never mind. Go down. And Where is this even going? Why did I not finish that off? It's supposed to be going into there, so I'll do that in a second. So I'm just gonna go up. Wait, no, the power line's there. Wait, I knew what I knew I knew what I was doing. That's why I needed the zone on, so there we go. No power. Hey. Ah, piss that up. I learned. So up there, across there, in there, up. My aim today is terrible. Okay, good. That looks nice to me. That doesn't need to be in there. Have I missed anything else that needs to be home zoned? Yes. There, there, 
This wall, of course, needs to be home zone. How did I miss that? Okay, I mean, I could just do it all, but then you get fires here and people try and put it out. It's like, there's no point. Okay, good. That should suffice for now. So we have a book goods trader and a stellar miner. Um, we have a little bit of cash. So let's call the stellar miner first of all. Sorry, Dibba, I didn't realise where you were. What were you doing? You don't know. Cans have been important, surely. So I'm on the lookout for a crafter and a social person. As I don't have a decent amount of either. So we can sell blue fur light leather. We're going to keep the weed, keep the ambrosia. Um, it's a shame they don't buy blocks because we've got lots and lots of them. Well, that's pretty much it. We could buy some plasteel, I think. It's really expensive though, at 13 a pop. We'll set this down at 337. That gets me 38. It's not a great amount, but it'll come in handy. Definitely come in handy. So, Mr. No, where are you at? You're playing chess. I think you're in a good enough mood. Come and discombobulate, thank you. Who's supposed to be on plank, plank cutting? It was Ant. Ant is unfortunately dead. So, go back onto construction for a while, Dibbet. After you've hauled that. And we'll get you building our power thing. Okay, good. This can be held open, I think. There's no reason for it to be shut. Nobody's installed the television yet. So can I get a few people to, like, move stuff to... Kim, what do you do? So you don't do a whole lot of anything. So do you want to deliver to frames and all that kind of stuff. Puke, you're catatonic. Samuel, what are you doing? You're hunting, hauling, cleaning, mining. Before mining, do you want to just help do this? Deliver to frames, thank you. There we go. Zong's on it. And I'm assuming Samuel will be on it as well. Fire phone pop popper back in space. Back in place, sorry. Hey you guys, we have TV. Excellent. So that's another recreation activity for people to do. Hey, Kim's on it already. Watching TV. Wonder what shows you can get out on the rim. Picks up transmissions from ancient satellites and ubiquitous data cards. Okay, fair enough. People are still going out through the kill box. I don't like that at all. To be fair, it's because they're working there. Kind of want them to go this way or this way. So. Let's build the electric thing first. Cutman, could you come and work on that? Zong, could you come and work on that? Zanyo, could you deliver to this? And can I get who was the other person I wanted to do something? Kim, was it? Yeah, I don't want you to work on it, I just want you to deliver to it, please. Do that. Let's work on the generator. It's more important than this little tiny bit of wall that we're trying to do. Still people going through the kill box. It's because you're building the spike track, that's okay. Okay, good. And you're still going that way. Are you soaking wet now because you stepped in the yeah, you stepped in the marsh. You see? This has gotta go. We have to bridge this. Well, I want to wait until the um, this is done, basically. So we will have a strong door somewhere, maybe not. We're gonna have to wait. Stepping in water is now soaking wet. Weird stuff. Yeah. <laughs> it's bad times, man. It's bad times. Maybe they, when they stepped in it, they fell over. And that's what happens every time they step in. They just go face first into the mud. Splash. 
Am I getting a negative on the side focus level for you? No. It sort of drops off shortly though. Your friend's death drop off as well. That's not too bad. Eight without a table. Mm, I've got tables over there in the base and I've got a table here. Covers most places. You must have been out here. Which is cool. Do we come and finish? Need steel. Okay, we need steel. Shit. Thought we had steel. Evidently we do not. Mr. No. When you wake up, I would like you to come and do this. What's your catharsis for? 23 hours. Okay, come now. Mood should increase. That's the biggie. 15 days left. Well, we'll get Mr. No to crack on with his steel, because we can't build the generator without it. Do we have any steel that we could, like... Yes, we do. So, somebody in a good mood. Song? Uh, yeah, you'll do. Come and... Schmelking! Schmelking! Uh, puke's up! Hey, welcome back, Puke. Good times. Not science crafting. Is anybody a science crafting anymore? No, apparently not. See, Dimmer could do it. He is butchering. Yeah, come and refine some steel, please. Um, so we're going to need part-time crafters. People are just going to like... Schmelt. Schmelting, schmelting. So people who are help, helping out in the construction stuff, like Kim, can smelt where available. And make stone blocks out of two if there's nothing to mine. Who was the other person? It was you, Zaniel. So what else do you do? You mine as well. So could you also assist? I don't know. We'll be fine. Okay, do you want to go and eat? The table that I was in use. Okay. Come smelt. Smelting! I don't, don't know where that comes from. So it's a mix of the um, Wicked Witch of the West, is it? Wicked Witch of the East? I don't know. I'm melting! Melting! And um, Gold Member, I think. Unfortunate smelting accident. Who knows how my mind works? That's yeah, pretty much the last of the slug. I'd really like to push armor production, but we can't do that. It's another reason why people have died quite a lot. They don't really have any armor. We don't have the materials for the armor. But we are not running out of food this winter, so... Do you know if we're not running out of food? Major break risk on Mr. No. Sorry, I completely forgot about you. There's literally only a couple to do, actually. Where's the next load of steel? Down yonder. Is that the closest? It's looking that way. Is there any in here? No, because I would have marked it up. Okay, so that's fine. We might be steelless for a while. Why is this so knackered? What the hell happened to that? Uh, Dibsy Malone, when you've done that, do you want to come and repair? In fact, no, Rachel, what are you doing? Hauling steel. When you've done that, could you come and like. Repair the bench, please. I just feel like that is an accident waiting to happen. It's a little short on steel for this. Come on, could you like just work on that while the blocks are there? Thank you. I may have holes in my walls. It's very disgraceful. Kim, could you come and work on that? Daniel, what are you up to? You're hunting a turkey with a revolver. <laughs> okay. Let's deconstruct that. Don't let me forget that's there because the parts will deteriorate in the water.
Oh, mad rat. Poor splinter. Shouldn't be too much of a problem. He's going for Cutman. Shot. Professional. What a lad. So he's building that, which means we can now do door there and wall there. We have power, power. Um, dibs can work on that, please. Just cut it. When you've done, uh, yo, finish it, bro. Come on. last piece to connect it there we go we're connected yes 6,000 excess okay so when winter comes we can actually put walls and roofs into this place now so what we will do is we're just going to structure in a few walls in random places so we here here uh, six apart isn't it so one two three four five six here be fine to keep the roof up. No, we'll readjust it. And now all that will get covered. And we're just going to 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So we need to do... Probably here will suffice. Or do I do here, here. Here and here is probably better. Let's see how that works. So I'll put the roof up and we'll test it once we've cleared the plants, of course. So the deep scanning, deep penetrating scanner, the ground penetrating scanner, I should say, is in place. We can't really afford to stop the research to get someone to crack on with that right now. I mean, we could do. We could do. We don't really need any research. None that I can think of anyway that's off the top of my head. But yes, I'm looking good. We'll see how this works. Did we cut the corner or did we just throw the um, blocks on top of it? We just threw the blocks on top of it. Okay, we should have probably cut the plants first. This is all ready to harvest anyway, so Dibber, if you're in a good mood. Yes, when you've done that, can you come and harvest that area? Might as well clean this room. What? Clean this room? Clean, clean it? No. Okay, it's not ready to harvest, that's why. this is though. So we can come and harvest this as well. Excellent. And what we'll do is we'll just put some lamps maybe here, here or something. Maybe there. There. Well, maybe one in each. Now that's 12,000 power. That's a lot of power that I can't afford. I can afford to maybe do two at max. Because I could always go and tap um, the other vent, wherever it may be. I seem to have lost it. It's there. It's a bit far away. And there is one south as well. That's probably the easiest one to do. So we'll do that one. What the hell's going on here? No, it's not my fault they died. 
wasn't my fault. <laughs> they were passing through and the animals attacked them. Oh well. Five meals for me. Is that biocoded? Nope. Nope. So I'll take all of this. Thank you. Ooh, fine meal. Tasty. Toxic fallout. Absolutely bloody fantastic. Right, let's slow this bad boy down. So, zones and roofs. It's good to run prepared for this, isn't it? Follow the carpet. Follow the, follow the carpet. Follow the concrete. That's the whole point of the concrete. Do this. Do that. Put this up there. Follow that. All of that. All of this. Oops. I'm going to random roof why not? Onto there. At least we can test out the. Um, we can't put the roof over that though. Can't put the roof over the helipad. Okay, that's the key places covered. So we're actually going to cover um, Taurus as well. Just in case we need to fight. And we're going to harvest all of this. Get everybody back home. People will stay in the base. Is there anything else I need to do whilst we're out of the base? Before the toxic fallout gets too bad. Um, this is my second bout of toxic fallout, by the way. Cutman, could you come and work on that, please? Get it all done quickly. Dibbert's cracking on with this. Have you got food on you, mate? Yeah, you do. So, do you want to eat? Could you eat there, please? He's standing, he's thinking, he's eating. Slowly. Let's get all this in please before it dies. We're gonna have to do this first of all, we're gonna have to like harvest everything now because it's all gonna die from the harvest, from the uh, toxic fallout. Let's get these roofs up though. There's still a miner coming in. I'm just going to finish this off. Yay, toxic fallout. Excellent. Snooze. <laughs> it is boring, isn't it? Massively boring. Okay, so Dibbert, go rest. Do I come and, like, just harvest this quickly, though? Stand of minor, I'm not really interested right now. Do I have people putting roofs up? Apparently, I don't for some reason. Do I? Do I not? No, I don't. Cutman's finished this, has he? Yes, we are power connected. Okay, nice. Nice, nice, nice. Not asked about that, actually. They can stay there. So, for the moment, for the short term, can everybody please stay in the base safety for now? Animal can stay in the base safety. And I'm just going to change it to toxic once I've done the areas. But we need to do something, and that something is this. We need a sun lamp. Um, I'm going to try and grow stuff. So there, there, there. Three is probably enough. So Cutman, could you come and need power lines, of course we do. Short and steel as well. Power line doing. Kim, could you come in there? Uh, work on the power line please. Roofs are going up, roofs are going up. Slowly. Maybe. Possibly. So while they're all doing this, we're just going to expand the uh, toxic zone to stay under roofs. As people should. We'll be allowed in here. It's all gone green! That covers everywhere, right? Yes, all the toxic places are in. So now we can restrict everyone to toxic and the animals to toxic, please. Put the roofs up quickly. 
this is kind of finished. Dibbert, you just really need to eat, so do you want to wake up so I can control you to do things, please? Should probably have let him eat first, whatever. So is that power in now? Yes, kind of, we missed a bit. Catatonic on Mr. No Life because his husband Yorg died. I kind of knew that was going to come anyway. The scrap trade, I'm going to deal with them because that makes us some cash. Dibbert's going to eat. Get those veg in, yeah, definitely. Definitely. 57 out of 60, got a bit of time with it. Song's on it anyway, so we sorted that. I mean, assault rifle. What do you mean you got an assault rifle? Oh, of course. I think you went down, didn't you? So there is a party. Huke's party. Try and get a few people involved in this. We need to get this cut very quickly. Hmm. Yorg died? Yep. Lots of people died. I lost so many people die. <laughs> so many people died last episode. It was it was not a fun episode. <laughs> Brandy did a number on me. Let like these have a party. Unable building unusable unusable because of roof. Okay, so can we remove roof on that, please? There we go, a bit of mood lighting. Mood lighting? Mood life. Oh, you asked for York too, did you? Oh, wait, wait. Did you? Oh, I missed it. Okay, I'll throw you in. Do you want to be Kim or Rachel? Which one would you like to be? We have Kim. We have Rachel. Two excellent specimens. Or are they? Dibs. Outside area toxic. Okay, so zone. Just for completion reasons, toxic. There we go. Can you build it now? Sandra, can you just like build it? Thank you. Alright, sun lamp is in. It's got a short circuit. <coughs> but it's in place. Which means we can now build a roof. Hopefully. Hopefully. Fingers crossed. Can we build a roof here? Is it gonna happen? Or is everything going to go tip up? So it's not got enough power. I have to turn off a few non essential items, I think. So this can definitely be uh, switched off for now, we're not using it. One of the benches can go down. Okay, there were butcher flying over as well, it's quite nice. Things I need to sort out right now, though. Could you come in? Oh, it's outside of the toxic area. Um, can I have you unrestricted for a sec? Yeah, come flip the switch. Okay, good. Get these roofs up. Should. Roof everywhere. We'll find out in a sec. Is that usable now? Yes, the telescope is now usable. Hopefully this toxic fallout won't last long. Going for Kim. No problems. Kim is cooking, shooting, underground at Ironwood and a night owl, incapable of caring, social, firefighting, has decent health. And then we have Rachel, who just can't fight. Skilled medic, apparently. <laughs> I beg to differ. Uh, night owl, but can build a mine. So we've got Kim and Rachel. Completely up to you, bro. <laughs> Rachel, I guess. Bad play. Yorg the second, he will join the colony and he will make sure that everybody performs to the best of their ability. Well, that's what it says in the brochure anyway. Both bad choices, yeah. Usually I have Yorg as a crafter and unfortunately I don't have a crafter right now. I'm really, really struggling for crafting people. But you are useful. 
Are we just like doing half a half a roof now, or are we just cracking on with it? Come on. Just need to heat this room as well. Neuro computation is finished. I'm actually going to check that out in a moment. So the roof is up. Okay, good. Indoors. Turn off that now. And we're going to need some form of lighting or maybe even some form of heating. It definitely needs to be heated, this. Um, so temperature control, the heating variety. Just put one there, one there. And there, one there. We're going to need some steel though because we really, really, really don't have any. How can we get some steel? Raid! Excellent! Mechs have dropped in right on top of us. There's three of them. No pause. Move quick. Go. Kill box. I'm back. Might be a Lancer. Watch out. Might be a Lancer. What is it? It's a fucking Lancer. Ooh, puke took a shot to the face. Come on, guys. Take it down. You guys suck. Move. Well, we'll head it off of the pass. Oh, it's dead. There we go. Nice. Uh, puke, you alright, mate? You already lost an arm. <laughs> He's just lost his leg. <laughs> oh, Dan. What am I doing? <sighs> Mr. No Life Cutman. I need a doctor. Is there a doctor in the house? Dibbert. He's the best doctor I've got. Dilbert. Already tending, okay. So he's lost a leg and he's lost a um, arm now. Fantastic. Let's get them hold. Let's get that and that hold urgently. We'll just put you on um, Unristicted whilst you do this. Okay. So I need to turn off a few more non-essential electrical components because we don't really have much to do uh, research. Yeah, we need some research. So let's do this kind of stuff. Let's have a look at our new toys as well. So what was it? Your calculator. Memory calculation. That calculator notepad embedded in the brain. Okay, so it makes people smarter. Is that what, is that what I'm talking about? A learning assistant. Strengthening the formation of new memories. So I'm wondering if it's like this one just helps skills go quicker, and this one just makes people just more intelligent. We can always try and Im implant them anyway. At the moment, we just can't because we don't have the doctors to do it. But so can I get you to like haul both of them, please? Uh, for the toxic zone, I'm going to need people to um, kind of go outside, but only to like here. Just because I still want stuff to get done. The group are passing by, no problems. I want to see Dibbert coming in here and uh, harvesting all of this, please. How oh, is he sick? Come on. So eight percent toxic build up. Okay. Maybe it was just, just while they were building the um building the roofs. Which is understandable. I do have Cutman uh, and Song at the moment who are unrestricted. So they can go out and do things. We will restrict them shortly. Cutman, come here. Yeah, it's a six percent. That's not too bad. So on this, we're going to allow sewing. Oops. On this, we're probably going to allow sewing. We're going to keep it going. We still need to heat the room. A raid as well. Fantastic. And we're going to use sappers to tunnel around my defensives. Defenses. Just the one group. There's just the one group. Cutman, come back. So I'm going to come through this wall, and it's a, oh, it's a multi-raid, okay. So it's mixed. 
So what we'll do is we will grab the crew. Come here. Not sure where they're going to come in. Are they chasing these guys? Oh, they're not bothered. No, no, they're not bothered. It says sappers. Well, they seem to be heading towards my kill box anyway. Unless I can get them to like come and join me. So I don't need to go there, please. Puke. No rush, mate. You just hop along at your own pace. It's 13 raiders. Where are they sapping? What the hell are they doing? They don't seem to be doing much. I could send somebody through to go and get them. Why are they... What? Okay, they're attacking my... Power. Okay, what are they doing? Here they come. Come on, we have mental breaks here. Maybe they're going down through the tunnels. Yeah, it looks like they are. So what we can do is we can hold these doors open. Unless they're coming through the south bit. Which I think they are. Yes, they're coming through the south bit, so we're going to go over here. I knew I should have mined this out. Problem is, I know that Puke can't run. Orbital factory, not the best time for an orbital factory. Shoot them as they come through. Come on, guys, you got a hole here. Why make another one? Okay, so we're just gonna bait them through and we're gonna run. Just a little bit, let's go. Oh, pure, poor Puke, I forgot about you. Going. Bring them up. Zong's down. And they're going to try and kidnap Zong. I don't think so. Okay, Dibbert. Dibbert. Can you, um, no, you've got no side focus, of course you don't. Oh, this is not going well. Where's Zong? Oh, he's being taken. No. Take him down, boys. Puke, step out. Come on, guys. That's it. So we got Kim back. Nice. I don't think we're going to catch you, so that sucks. So, Cutman, could you rescue there, please? Zong was kidnapped. Yep, saw that coming. Puke, could you rescue Kim? Well, that could have gone much worse. It was a bit shit, though. Oh, we're not prepared for raids at the moment. So, this is the worst group of colonists I've ever had. I've had some bad colonists, but these guys so On the plus side, he had some gold, some components, and plastic, though. Unless he tried to steal it from me, and then. Which he might have done. No, that's new gold. Hey, new gold. Well, we have lost a couple of people here. Let's look at the triage situation. Kim is in no immediate danger. It was 12 hours. The is 6 hours. Samuel is no immediate danger. Okay, Cutman, can you heal people? Kind of. Why do you ignore me, Cutman? Come on. I need doctors right now. So Zong was kidnapped. Rip. There's a very good chance that Zong's going to die. We do have a potential prisoner here, though. Uh, bleeding out in one hour, never mind. That's a shame. You would have been nice. 
Oh, it's nice to have another doctor. So I'm actually going to have to unforbid these as well. If it wasn't toxic fallout, things would be much easier. But unfortunately, it is. And everyone's in the hospital. Yorg, are you fixed? Nope, can you get back in bed, please? Cotman, could you come and. Um, yeah, thank you. Read my mind, sir. Puke, how are you doing, mate? <laughs> lost his leg, lost his arm. Ah, he's on a catatonic breakdown again. Fantastic. Things are just going really, really badly. Um, okay, Dibbert. Disease infection on Zanyo. We are treating that at the moment. We're treating that at 42%. Mm, I've seen worse. No, we'll just leave Cutman just lying there. It's fine. No problems. Okay. Starvation as well on a couple of people, so we'll get them fed shortly. Cut me, you don't really need to be cleaning. Is everybody sorted now? Everyone's okay. Do you want to like rescue Puke? There we go, fix him up. What do you need, mate? Everything. Ugh. Okay, do I feed some people? Fantastic. And apparently you don't want to feed some people. So could you come and feed um, Mr. No, please? Let's feed Puke as well. Could you, Zaniel, feed Puke? Mm -hmm. No, we Okay, Cotman, could you feed Puke? Alrighty. What's the starvation taken care of? It should be. Yes, Hunter that's a ranged weapon, which is Kim. Which I'm assuming is out here somewhere. Yes, there. Kim. Could you come and equip that, please? Yorg also needs a weapon. Could you come and equip that, please? Let's we'll see if we can get some better weapons. I'm sure there's other weapons around. There's a couple of LMGs, but. The light machine guns aren't that fantastic. Tatted up morale, major bravery has gone several people. Okay. There is a bear inside as well. It's not hungry, but there is a bear nonetheless. Let's get the bodies hauled. I feel like I need to kill the bear. It's not an issue right now. To repair these doors as well, which Cutman's gonna have to do. Um, can you come and smoke a joint, please? Followed by drinking some beer. Where's my beer? Where's my beer gone? Damn it. Okay, much better mood. There we go, it's high. Definitely ran out of beer. That sucks. So, with you being in a good mood, could you work on these limestone doors, please? Let's get the security of the complex back in. Before we have more breaks, please. I think he should be okay. Cornish needs treatment, which is Zaniel. Uh, so, let's get a doctor to do that. Mr. No. Can't walk. How are you feeling, mate? Uh, 42 immunity on 40% infection, that's fine. We're going to treat it at 88, 38%. Okay, should be okay. Should be okay. Those doors are done. So we need to do the wall next. And of course, we need to fix whatever damage was done over here, which was nothing. They just threw grenades at the wall and didn't actually um, make it through. So that's quite nice. Did they destroy any power lines though? They did not. Okay, good. 
We're actually okay. We got away with the power lines this time. We have a quest. Saving a refugee. 44 year old healer named Jen is calling from nearby. She's being chased by tribes people. She begs for safety and offers to join us. I accept. We'll have to fight off the um, tribes people. Which consists of 20, 30, 40 people. Okay. Now it expires in two hours. Jenny's actually rather good. She's a doctor. She's got some. She's a wimp though. That sucks. Creepy breathing with a chemical interest. That could be a crap combination. Um, she's gonna go down constantly. But she's a medic. Good with animals. Now she's got asthma. How old is she? 44. I kind of need people right now, and I especially need doctors. Are we in a position to fight off 40 people? Got two hours to decide. How's the kill box? Actually, okay, because they're going to come through the kill box. Okay, let's do it. Let's do it. <laughs> if all else fa if all else fails, you know, what could go wrong? What could go wrong? Oh, we've got holes in the walls, and I've just accepted this quest. Oh no. Oh no, we've got holes in the walls and I accepted a quest. Um, is the toxic fallout gone? Oh, toxic fallout's gone. Oh, I'm so glad that that was quick. Randy must know how much I'm struggling with this. So Jen, I need you to come here now. Equip that please, which way are you coming in? Oh, there's holes in those walls. We did not think this through. Should not have accepted this quest. This is going to be the end. I've made a terrible error in judgment. Terrible, terrible error in judgment here. What have I done? I know. Death on Dimitri the Arctic Wolf. What have I done? Terrible error in judgment. The hospital's still in one piece though. Just get into the kill box, guys. Come on. This is the first time we're going into the kill box. Oh my god, what have I done? What have I done? Made a mess here. Jen's down already. The guys in the hospital, the hospital are actually okay. Kim's down. What have I done? Oh, they're fleeing. Okay. I did it all in the control. No problems. I had it under control, I knew what I was doing the whole time. I knew what I was doing. I had this. No problems. No problems. No immediate danger, okay. Okay. I knew what I was doing. He was never in doubt. <laughs> Oh, I didn't realise there was holes in the wall. You know when you accept a quest like that? And I always think to myself, it's fine. Spawn over here, it'll be cool. Not there. And hey, we've got a prisoner. Hey, we've got a prisoner. Oh, people are going to be pissed at me. Uh, could you, like, rescue Kim? What the hell? Uh-oh. The mortars are going to explode. See, this is why we put walls in place, to protect the other mortars. I'll just get you to shoot that person now, why not? Pew! Good shot. Alright, this base is in a bit of a mess. So death in 12 hours, death in 4 hours. Okay, Cutman, I need you to attend there first, please. Thank you. Zaniel, I need you to like. Um, you don't do doctoring. Death on Divot, what? 
Did I click finish off? Surely not. No, he just died. What? Ah. <sighs> no. How did he die? He had four hours left. What? Ah. Okay, we've lost our initial colonist. Oh, sorry, Dibber. You're dead. You're dead, mate. You're dead. Uh, Mahina the Great. No worries. We'll put you in as Jen, assuming that you're going to survive. <laughs> See what happens. Uh, spell it right, Dan. Spell it right. Welcome to the colony. Perfect time to uh, join, of course. Title inheritance. Since Vermin died, his title has been transferred to his heirs according to the laws of the faction. Uh, he's not actually. Oh, no one was dedicated. Oh, no one was dedicated as an heir. <laughs> um, I made a mess. Okay. Look at the state of this place. <sighs> My bedroom as a teenager would tidier than this. Okay, I'm here now. What you're saying? What you're saying? What you're saying? You'll be okay. Dibber is a bit dead. Kim, death in 23. Yog, you'll be okay. Puke still cast tonic. So, doctor, please, cut. Could you come and tend to Kim, please? Just stop the bleeding. Yog, you seem to have got out of bed. Nope, you're still in bed. Zanya, what are you doing, mate? Your infection. 72 versus 76. You've been tended, can be tended again. So what we need to do now is remove all these roofs at some point. Purely because I need the rain to wash the blood away. Know what I mean? Know what I mean? When it rains, right, it's because there's no way we're cleaning this anytime soon. We also need to fix the holes in the walls before we get raided again, which is probably, knowing Randy, going to be in about five minutes' time. Or we'll get a manhunting pack of wild caribou or something coming in. Because, you know, why not? So those roofs are coming down. This can actually be ignored now, it doesn't exist. Uh, the prisoners, I'm not really that bothered about. It's bleeding out in five hours. We could get one prisoner. He's a constructor builder. Alright then. So, Samuel, can we capture, please? I don't know what you were doing, but do it. Beacon unusable. Yep, because it's broke. Corners needs treatment. Corners left unburied. So, let's get you moved by somebody. Can you walk yet? No. Cutman, Kim. Kim, you can walk. Could you hold, please? I know you're not the fastest, but thank you. Medical emergency on Zanuel. 82 versus 79. Tended to 38%. Contend in one hour. Okay, we're going to have to tend that. I don't think he's going to make it with this prisoner, actually. We're going to have to get somebody else to carry it. Um, I think we can speed up now. Who can actually walk? Y'all can walk. Do you want to come and tend? Not assigned to doctoring. Well, you should be. Everybody should be on doctoring right now. So, Yog, do you come and tend there, please? Zaniel, could you come and rest, please? Oh, finish your meal. Sorry, my bad. Then come and rest. Mr. No, can you walk? No. Cutman, where are you at? You're sleeping in your own bed, okay. Livestock wranglers we don't care about. I'm going to have to start tidying things up, surely. Kim, what are you doing? Something. No idea. So, Zaniel's coming in. How's my mate Shark doing? Death in two hours. Should be okay. So, we'll get Yorg to come and tend to Zaniel. Very, very quickly. Unless Mahina can do it. Nope. Still can't walk. 
You already watched some of my streams and guess you won't survive for long. <laughs> Excellent for the vote of confidence there. <laughs> yeah, you're probably right though. Yeah, this is going not very well right now. So 94 versus 92 is actually going to be okay without the tend, I think. But I don't really want to... Could you now come and tend to Zaniel, please, since he's stopped leading? Any tend will do, I think. Should be okay. 97 to 96. 98 to 97. Any kind of tend will do. 59, that'll be fine. So Zaniel should be up. Develops immunity. Off you go, bro. We got what now? What's up? Oh my god. <laughs> ah, quest available. Supplies for the Choco Field. I feel like I'm in Final Fantasy now. Uh, would they like to purchase eight flak pants? Sorry, mate, but I don't think. Oh wow, prestige marine helmet as well. And a neuro trainer for cooking. Neuro trainer for medical. Oh, that'd be amazing, but we can't really make eight flak pants. Spies mm. in 14 days. Okay, I've got 14 days. Mm -mm -mm. I can do this. Why is that there? Go away. Go away. Hey, where's my UI gone? What? Oh, come on. <laughs> I've got no UI. That's a problem. Okay, that's a nice visual bug, isn't it? Um, okay. Excellent work, Rimworld. Can't really report bugs anymore, can we? I'm going to save and quit to OS. No, save, save and quit to menu. Sorry, guys. It was broken. Let's try again. Oh, come on, don't be the straw that's brought the camel back here. Camel's back. That'll be bad. Spawning things. Should be okay. It's having a struggle. Okay, we're good, we're good. Back on it. Right, so. Technical difficulties. Um, it's unforbid most things anyway. We need to get rid of these bodies before they cause massive new problems. Wow. Nice. <laughs> Why did I accept that raid? Cost Dibbert his life. Samuel, could you very just quickly just do Dibbert, please? We don't get colonists left unburied. There we go. Rip, debit. Okay. Clear prioritize work. So, Cutman, you seem to be in a pretty decent mood considering what's happened. Um, what can I get you to do? I think I need to get you to repair the walls first of all. Oh, go away. Come on. We have a raid coming in from multiple angles. We can't really fight this off, I don't think. If you are able bodies, please come here. Got no traps left either. The end is nigh! And we've got holes in the walls over here. Does everyone have a weapon? That is a no. Got three abled fighters. Ah. <sighs> The fun button exists, yeah, it seems that way, doesn't it? Got no turrets, so I don't know where I'm running to. <laughs> Good shot, though. I think this might be the end. Run, boys, run, just run around the corner. And Kim's going on a smoke leaf binge. Fantastic. Excellent timing. Uh, it's going to go wrong. 
Suggestions welcome, by the way. <sighs> hey, Miles, how's it going, man? Nice to see you. As you can see, things are taking a turn from the worst. That's probably because of my fault, not the storyteller. I kind of like messed up a little bit. Oops, death on York the second. <laughs> Come when you're on your own, mate. Daniel, equip yourself. We will fight to the last. Take these boys out. Pew, pew, pew. Come on, boys, defend the colony. That's it, one down. Take him down. There's a man from behind. Take him down. Okay, that third group fleeing. No, don't attack them, attack him. Come on, both of you. Attack him. Take him down. Okay, good. Now, next group. Let's go. Wait, what? <gasps> Kidnap Kim? No! <laughs> it's all going wrong! Right. <sighs> Should I even be looking at Days on Cutman yet? Kim kidnapped, you're killed. Smoke this binge on Kim. Kim's gone. Cargo pods. What did we get in the cargo pods? Ooh. Wool cloth. So what's on fire? They destroyed my ground penetrating scanner. And the world is just burning. Excellent. How do I recover from this? Look at the state of it. Can you come and like bury Yog, please? Or do something? Uh, all Yog. Is there any way back from this? Is it possible? I don't know that it is. I have starvation on Mahina as well. You could do with some defenses, yeah. All my defenses are wrecked. Killbox is gone. This was the worst killbox I've ever built. I'm never building like that again. I'll build it properly next time. I'm going to double wall my walls. Like I usually do, because that is terrible. That was too easy to get through. Too many places as well, I can't even patch it up when it does that. The point of be double wall in it is usually you just get one hole, not like one, two, three, four, five, six. So it's easy to patch up between raids. So I need you to cremate there, please. No, just cremate Yorg. Just get Yorg gone. Start over now. Could do. Could start over now. I'm not, I'm not beaten yet. I can come back from this. I can do it. I came back from the last uh, mess up. <laughs> We've still got plenty of food. Oh, actually, we need that fixing. Samuel, could you like work on the cooler? <laughs> Just like, no, go to bed. <laughs> Oh, sorry, you can clear your prioritised work, my bad. Ah, you have no life, this looks like a remake job. Eh? See, I could do, could do. One thing I could do is I could start over. <laughs> but it was going so well, though, was it? We're three years in and we have a colony, things are in place. It'd be such a shame to say goodbye to it. I'd be sad. I'd be very sad. Hmm. I'll decide. I've got 20 minutes left of my usual streaming time anyway, so I'm going to finish the stream as we are, and then I'll decide what the um, best course of action is. Oops. Well, I may come back with a new campaign, you think? We'll do it no pause again. But it won't be remaking today anyway. Yeah, we just did double walls, we need to rebuild everything. We'll see what happens. Six Skylands is something I'd like to play. I don't really have time to do it at the moment, that's my issue. Time is limited. Streaming time. 
RimWorld I can fit in two hours a day. That's not a problem. I want to play Pokemon trading card game. I do want to play City Skylines. We'll see. See what happens. So you're doing some cremation or you're just hauling. Okay, you're doing that. So can I get you to like remove roof area? Ah, I shouldn't have done that. Cancelled. <laughs> Puke, could you? No, you're not assigned to constructing. Plus you can't walk. Should we put you on construction for a bit? Um Okay. This bear is just like scaring me of where it is. I keep thinking it's just going to snap on me. Just take this map and then try a game, but with good enough kill box and such. Yeah, that would be a good shout, wouldn't it? <laughs> that would be a good shout. Hey, Nimble Slough with the host. Thank you very much, dude. Hope your day is going well. But yeah, I'm gonna try and try and fix this for about 20 minutes and then give up. I think. Ah, oh, tis the end of a colony. Small leaf binge on Mahina. Yeah, go for it. Go get stoned. You're probably just gonna knock yourself out though. You're actually not too bad, considering. You can take that many injuries. I think next campaign as well. I'm gonna be more selective with my pawns because. I kind of like just took any pawns in this run through and I think it was a bad idea. We just have problems on problems. So I'm going to be a bit more, um, a bit more, uh, yeah, a bit more selective with them. Aloha, Nimble Slothy. My favourite of the Nimble Sloths. It's a true story. Cutman's broke. Mr. No's down. You're broken. Zaniel, you do anything. Could you come on, like, to the cooler. Mr. No, who's always got the sloth breathing down his neck. <laughs> uh, I'm a poor good trader, but that's not going to help me refix this place. I still need components anyway. Puke seems to actually be in a rather good mood considering how bad he is. He's in a shoot frenzy, that's not going to help him. Can't build that though, is he taking down roofs? Is that what he's doing? No, he's not even taking down roofs. What are you doing, Puke? You've gone to bed. Okay. Well, could you come and like... Bing! Remove roof areas. But I fully hold my hands up, that was my fault for losing the colony by accepting that raid when I wasn't in any fit state to do it. Yeah, being picky about Carnus is a good thing. The problem is I wasn't picky this time around, I just took anyone. And we had loads of delinquents and people who were just useless at things. But never mind. On the plus side, at least they've moved the majority of the dead bodies. <laughs> and this is actually lagging the screen quite so much because they've queued up so many jobs. Probably cancel it really. <laughs> so do we start again then? Is that is that the shout? Is that what we're doing? I think it might be. I think this is dead. This is done. We never really got to play with the uh, throne either in the throne room. It's going to be Naked Brutality again? I think so. Here comes the rain. Still got all the roofs up though. Cummins back. I think I can resurrect this campaign. I don't think I'm beaten yet. I actually believe that I can win this. Hmm. 
Does anyone else believe that I can do this? Or is it just me? It's going to really slow down the frame rate. Yeah. Whoops. <laughs> Too far into the story to recover, you reckon? Hmm. I don't know. I'm so stubborn. So stubborn. <laughs> Puke, you're still alive, but you've only got one leg and one arm. Next raid is going to be Annihilation because of my value, yeah, probably. But could I patch up the walls and get the raid sorted? Could I get my five colonists back on track? I've been trying out a new uh, game, definitely need to invest some money into it though, which is a new CCG. Just remove home area. <laughs> Bye home area! <laughs> Not sure it works like that. Puke, you're like the worst person for trying to like remove roofs. You're terrible at it. Wait, I'm gonna. I thought it was gonna rain. Dry thunderstorm. Come on. Um. Yeah, I think this campaign's dead. Dead, dead, dead. Should we start a new one this episode and then? Uh, Carry on. Can we eat cutman? Of course we can. We can eat cutman. Cutman. Hmm. How can we get you to die? I have an idea. So I'm gonna drop all your gear, get you naked. Eventually. <laughs> you can tell it's the end now, it's definitely at the end now, we're gonna start again. So come on melee a bear. Let's see who wins. I'm I'm oh. My money was actually on Cutman, but never mind. Um <laughs> So Mr. No, now that you're up, come here. Is that still pissed? It's still pissed. I have to deal with this first. Can you come out? Ah, no! Not happy bear. There we go. Oh, it's ran. Take it down, take it down. Okay, cool. Now, could you come and, um, come here, come here, yeah. okay then, could you, how do we kill Cutman? Oh, you don't have the, um, the skill for it, melee skill of six, does anyone have a melee skill of six? There we go. Puke. Don't save him. Don't save him. Don't do it. Oh, he's dead. Okay, he's dead. Cool. So, <laughs> um, Mr. No. Trying to like um, eat some cutman? There we go. Puke. You like some cutman, don't you? Um, nom 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 nom. <laughs> Just going to eat him raw, yeah? Nom 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 nom. Excellent stuff. Mr. Puke, you're going to come and eat cutting in as well, please? So I'll have a nibble. Mmm, tasty. You will eat the whole corpse, please. I can't select him. <laughs> Missing body parts, 27%. Mr. Puke, come and consume some cutting, please. So yes, we're gonna eat Cutman and then we're done. But we're gonna <laughs> see the colony we deserve. <laughs> Isn't the colony we deserve, but it's the colony we need. Yeah man. 
Oh, Cohen, you taste so good. Mmm, tasty. What do you think about that? Raw cannibalism. Mmm, that's crazy. Right, rest in peace, Colony. It was a valiant effort. We're going to start again. Um, but we're going to start again next episode anyway. We're going to end this one here. It was fun. We got all of the thick cup in here. Exactly. So we're going to start again. Merciless Naked Brutality. No pause again. Uh, we have to pick a character from the first set of people. In fact, no we can't. We can re-roll because we end up with someone who can't craft and can't construct and that kind of stuff. Which is bad. They need to be able to craft a weapon. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it, I think, for this. <sighs> Can you not, like, fight each other? Is that not a thing? No, you can't fight each other. Okay. Anyway, but we'll start that tomorrow. It's going to be fun. I'll probably be streaming it around about 8pm UK time. Give or take an hour. But yeah, if you've enjoyed it guys, as much as I have, please hit the follow button. But never mind. We'll catch up next time. So thanks again guys. And I'll catch you later. Ciao for now. <laughs>